Hey guys, this is Annelise from VSU Software. Today I'm going to show you how easy it is to create your own Christmas DVD with your custom menu, custom audio in the background and entirely for free with our VSU programs. It's super easy and once you get the hang of it, you'll be able to custom your menus not just for Christmas but any occasion. Okay, so let's get started. So step one is obviously to get those uh, Christmas movies onto your PC if you don't already have them. And for this, you're going to need our VSO downloader program. So Google our website, VSO software, and download the free downloader. And this will enable you to download any streaming videos that you'll find on the internet. You'll also need another product from us called Convertix to DVD. And this will enable you to convert your your videos to a nice DVD. So um, if you don't already have it, you can take advantage of the free seven day trial. So click on the, the green button here. And for the first seven days, the whole software is entirely free to use. So it's not a demo, it's full and free. So once you have those two uh, software, we'll move on to step two. So now you need a website where you can download streaming videos for free. Um, I usually use Project Free TV, that's projectfreetv.so. And we're going to download Miracle on 34th Street. That's a classic Christmas movie. So first thing is to open the VSO downloader and just leave it there. It's going to work on its own. Now watch the video. So press play. There you go. And that's it. My, um, my movie has already been detected and downloaded. So just rename it. Miracle. And that's it. You don't have anything else to do. Just wait for it to be downloaded. You have an estimated time of 20 minutes. You can actually um, close the video, close the website, because now it's going to work on its own. So we're going to download another uh, classic Christmas movie. The Grinch, so same thing, click on play, and there you go. The downloader is working fine. Rename the video, and just now you just have to wait for the both videos to be downloaded, okay? And then we're going to move on to step three, which is uh, downloading the audio for the DVD menu. So now let's add some music to the uh, DVD menu. Obviously that step is optional because you don't need to add music if you don't want to or you can use the audio from the movies you're converting. But uh, I'm going to download some classic Christmas music from Frank Sinatra from musicmp3.ru and same thing for the vid as for the videos. You open your VSO downloader, it's still downloading the movies and now I'm just going to play uh, the tune that I want and it's going to be detected and downloaded as well. Okay, let's let's go for Silent Night. There you go. You can stop the music. As you can see, it's there in my download list and it's going to be downloaded in minutes in MP3 format. Okay, so let's move on to step four, which is to add the videos to the Convertix to DVD and create the menu. Okay, so now you need to open your Convertix to DVD program and insert the file that you've just downloaded. So, Grinch and the Miracle. So this is the tree view of the project. Oh, the project, sorry. And uh, we're going to use the menu template called Black Mirror. And if you click there on the left, you will open all the uh, menu feature features. Um, so we have two videos in our project. So I'm going to work on the title menu parameters, which is the first one that will show when you insert your DVD. If you only have one video in your project, then you'll need to work on the root menu parameters, because in that case, that's the, the, the one that will be shown first. Um, but this time, the steps are exactly the same. So for the title menu parameters, I click there and I'm going to change the background uh, image. We're going to start with a still image and then later I'll show you how to add the video. So um, double click there and choose the custom file. Now I've just downloaded a nice Christmassy template. Um, 
if you want to, uh, there are loads on the internet. So if you want to download one, the one, the website I'm using for those are is uh, called Free Pick, and you'll find loads of templates, not just Christmas. So back to our um, Converse to DVD. So this is it. You just press OK, and that's it. Now let's add some audio. Uh, use the custom file that we've just downloaded. So that's Silent Night. And uh, if you want to extend the duration of the audio or of the the, uh, the, um, the actual duration of the menu, you can do so here. Um, let's move it to 30 seconds. And this is it. This is what it looks like. <laughs> Okay, so let's now add a video to the background. Uh, the steps are exactly the same as for the, the image. So click on background video image and use a custom file. I've actually just downloaded a nice video of um, snow falling down from YouTube with VSO downloader. So now the, um, the software just asked me if I wanted to keep the video that the, the audio that comes with the video. So I said yes, um, even though you'll see that it's actually a silent video. And this is what it would look like. So it's quite a nice um, Christmassy feeling. And another thing you can do with the software is to use the video um, in the background from um, one of the the movies you've just um, you've inserted in your project. So we're going to do that now. So let's pick the miracle, for instance. Okay, so again, I'm going to use the audio track, and this time we're going to hear it. Um, the one of the, ni wha the nice thing about the software is that you can actually indicate a starting time from the video. So if you have a, like a special part that you really like and you want to use in the background, you just have to indicate the the time here. So I'm just going to randomly use two minutes, and uh, this is what it looks like. Open the door. I'm sorry, the store isn't open today. And I Okay, so now you know how to customize your DVD menu. Uh, there are a few more things that you can actually do. Uh, for instance, because I've added two videos uh, by default, um, the name of the project is uh, the first file, the name of the first file, but you can ch change this and actually. Um, I'm going to call it, I'm going to call it my Christmas videos. You can also change uh, the font and uh, the color um, of the the all the text you add, and uh, this is uh, what it looks like. Sorry, with the new title. There, my Christmas videos. So. There you are. Now you just need to convert the videos, and um, once they're converted, you'll you can burn them onto a DVD disc or put them on a, a USB key if your DVD player or your TV will read it. And this is it. Now you know how to customize a DVD menu, whether it's for Christmas or for any other occasion. So well done to you, and uh, the whole VSO team and myself wish you a very happy holiday. <laughs>